Hi, this project is a demonstration of personality prediction system. This will enable a more effective way to shortlist submitted candidates from a large number of applicants. System will rank CVs based on the experience and other key skills which are required for particular job profile. Candidate can give an online test which will be conducted on personality questions as well as aptitude questions. This system will help the human resource department to easily shortlist the candidate based on the CV ranking policy. The system will help the human resource department meant to select the right candidate for particular job profile which in turn provide export workforce for the organization let's see how the system works there are two models one is user login and another one is admin login let's see the admin login admin must enter the id and the password to login to the system Once the admin logins to the system these are the modules the admin can access aptitude question personality question job details under job details that are add job details preferred cvs requirement details shortlist cv and in view details view personality question aptitude question and view job details so first we will see the aptitude question in aptitude question the admin must enter the aptitude question first he must select the type and the question and the option for particular question and the right answer once the admin clicks on to the submit button these details will be added into the database and can be viewed by the user let's see the next model that is the personality question over here the admin must specify the personality question and the various options once the admin clicks on to the submit button these details will be added into the database let's see the next module that is job details under job details the first module that is add job details over here let's say the job details module over here the job id is automatically generated by the system here the admin must specify the designation and the salary the salary can be per annum basis and the place Once he clicks on to the submit button, these details will be added to the database. Let's see the next module that is requirement details. Over here, admin must select the job ID and he must specify the number of experience, qualification, and the key skills required for this job. Let's enter the experience and qualification as well as the key skill and click on to the submit button. These details will be updated into the database. Let's see the next module, preferred CVs. Over here, the admin must select job ID and he must select the CVs which are preferred for this job profile. And once he clicks on to the upload button, these files are uploaded and he must click on to the scan button. Over here, we had applied an algorithm where system will scan the various CVs which had uploaded by the admin it will scan those cvs which is apt for this job profile and it will give a point for each category that is qualification experience and language let's see the uh, next one that is preferred cvs over here the admin must select the job id and he must select uh, the cvs which are apt for this job profile once he clicks on to the upload button this files will be shown over here and click on to the scan button Here we had applied an algorithm which will scan the various CVs uploaded by the admin and it will uh, give us uh, some point for qualification experience language and specialization for particular CVs let's see the next module that is shortlist CV the admin must select the job id system will display the experience qualification and key skills for that particular job id and you must click on to the scan CV over here the candidate CVs are scanned and shown over here which is apt for the criteria and here you can see that resume as well as the student name as well as the expected values which are required and the CV values these are the CV values which are from preferred CVs and these are the expected CVs 
means these are the minimum value that is expected from particular series and if you want to see the result once the admin clicks on to the result but he can see the personality score as well as the graph of the personality as well as the aptitude let's see the next module that is view details and under view details we can view the personality questions these are the personality questions which are added by the admin and you can edit as well as delete the questions and you can update if any changes required for particular question and you can click on to the update button and these details will be updated into the database let's see the next module that is view aptitude question over here admin can update and delete the aptitude questions by clicking on edit you can update the aptitude question as well as you can delete the question by clicking on to the delete button let's see the next model that is view job details over here admin can view the various job details as well as their designation salary and place and the admin can edit as well as delete the job details this is how the admin model works let's see the next model that is the user log user must enter the id and the password to log into the system if the user is a new member he can register himself by clicking on to the sign up button and he must specify following details and he must upload the resume over here and once he clicks on to the upload button he will get an submit button and these details will be added into the database by using the id and the password he can access the system as i had already registered myself so i'll be using the id and the password to log into the system Once the user clicks on to the login button, he must give a test personality question. I'm just selecting few of them. And click on to the next button. This is our aptitude questions. Click on submit button. So these are the uh, result of my uh, test personality traits as well as the app, and this is my personality score. So this is how the user login works. This is how personality prediction system works. Thank you.